Hi guys, it's me Erica. So today we'll be making the sign that Deku has on his door from My Hero Academia that features his love for All Might. And this is a pretty easy DIY to do. Um, and since Christmas is coming up, this is a great gift to give to your friends that if they love My Hero Academia or just a new piece of decor to lighten up your room or just make it a little bit, bit different. So with that, let us get started. So the supplies you will need for this project are a piece of wood. I bought these stack of wood pieces at Michael's. Twine, brushes, acrylic paint, craft foam, scissors, a sharpie, and some type of hot glue or glue. So the first step we'll be doing is painting the wood blue. Uh, the blue that I'm using, I think I needed to put two coats. So we'll put as many coats as you need to cover up the wood pieces. And while that is drying, we can move on to cutting the foam. So with the foam cutting, I decided to print out a picture of Deku's uh, wall so I can get kind of the shape and proportions that I wanted to get, or I just basically trace it out on Sharpie. And when you're doing this, make sure so that you don't see the Sharpie to do it on the opposite side that you don't want to be using. So in order to do that, I think I flipped the craft foam so that I wouldn't be able to see the sharpie stains until I had to do it again for another step. So after tracing your foam, go ahead and cut it out. Since it looked a little bit blandish, I decided to outline the foam pieces in sharpie but not uh, heavy, just kind of just lightly. Uh, covering them so we can give some definition to it. So once those foam pieces are done, go ahead and go back to actually painting the wood piece. So from here, I decided to uh, do the red paint, which are like this half kind of semicircles at the bottom, and then highlight them with um, uh, white paint later. And then after doing that, I decided to write uh, the names in kind of like block letters with the paint. I ins I put Izuku on it just because I didn't know what else to put. Uh, but of course, if you're going to be using your own name or you're giving it to a friend, go ahead and write their name or whatever you desire. After that is dry, I decided to glue on the foam pieces and the twine together. You can definitely use hot glue for this, it's probably a lot faster. But I didn't want to get my hot glue out, so I just ended up using some wood glue that I had and uh, attached the foam and the twine together. If you are using hot, uh, glue, for instance, you probably do need something to hold down the pieces so that they stick together. I accidentally messed up on the wording, so I don't know if I actually videotaped it, but I spilled like white paint on a lot of stuff by accident, so I ended up just covering it up with blue again once the white paint is dry. So you can always start over again if you mess up. So after that, you're finished with the sign, and it's pretty easy. It only takes a simple step, but it does bring a little bit of the anime to your room, because I know I've been like at a loss of what to watch because My Hero Academia is not airing anymore until when season 4 comes out. So <laughs> anything that reminds me of the anime, I'm happy to do. So hopefully you like this DIY and if you like this DIY or the any or any of them that are featured in this channel, be sure to share them using the hashtag IRADIYs on Instagram, Twitter, or Tumblr. Uh, I know I haven't been making a lot of videos. Uh, I, I know it's really, I, I get really like sad about it, but 
hopefully you guys still enjoy this even though it is a pretty short and simple DIY and hopefully uh, once winter rolls around uh, I'll be more a little more active so yes again thank you so much for watching and see you next time bye